Uh, hello, my name is Cesar Montero and in this tutorial I'm going to show you two different ways of importing a mesh into Unreal Engine. The fastest and easiest way is to drag and drop your FBX into the content browser. This is going to be in a menu such as this because I'm dealing right now with a mesh in Maya that looks like this. I want to make sure that upon import, I unclick, uncheck the static mesh, skeletal mesh, sorry, option. I'm going to show you right now what happens when I leave this option called combine meshes on. So I'm going to put import all. What this is going to do is that it's going to create a single mesh out of all the different meshes that I have in Maya. That's for some. They, they might want to do that, but I'm doing it right now So be, because I'm going to show you a second way of doing it through a different menu that you can actually have all of these separated. Okay, that's done. Now, if I drag and drop this because it combined the meshes, it's going to be just a single object. So you can see here it's interior two. I drag and dropped it. I'm going to delete that. And I'm going to show you a better way of doing this. If you go to the file uh, menu and then go all the way down to import into level in this actor section, you're going to have a, me um, uh, a Windows menu that allows you to select the, the files you want to have imported. Click open. It's going to tell you, hey, do, where do you want to import it? I'm going to select content. Uh, this option is going to let you have uh, different options on how do you want to import the mesh. One of the things I really like about this menu is the capacity of selecting which which of the meshes in Maya to import. So this is what we have here on the left. Um, so uh, another option I like is that you can select if if you want your your asset to create actors on the right side. Uh, you want to have everything as a, sing as a single actor with different components or create one blueprint asset. Um, if you want to have a kind of like a, the, the most one-to-one uh, -one from Maya to Unreal Engine, uh, select all uh, and leave this one to create level actors. Okay, so we finished importing. As you can see, now we have all our meshes on the the right side you can drag and drop I mean you can drag and, uh, and, and move does it think a little bit there you go so uh, it, it even um, imported the correct location rotation and scale of the Maya file because the Maya file has only one material well everything has the default gray um, there you go there's more things to be done to this scene such as uh, making sure that uh, you know everything if you want to be fr uh, have it like a frozen uh, transformation to do that in Maya but that's that's uh, something for another tutorial I hope this was helpful and uh, thank you subscribe to my channel if you want to know more about Unreal Engine